I first lived here in Victoria Street when I was a kid during the Second World War. And I come from the country and it was fairyland and Hollywood and everything that means anything to a kid. There were literally tens of thousands, perhaps hundreds of thousands of people here. It was reputed to be the most densely settled, I think, white area in the world in those days. And there were always people at every hour of the day and night. You could get a meal 24 hours a day, it was full of coffee shops, places where people would meet. Everybody knew everybody else, which was remarkable in such a large population. I've come back to the cross over the years. Uh, I was living abroad for a very long time. When I came back to settle in Australia, there was absolutely no question that I would live anywhere else. And I bought the house which I'm now living in, in Victoria Street. I first lived here in Victoria Street when I was a kid during the Second World War and I'd come from the country and it was fairyland and Hollywood and everything that means anything to a kid. There were literally tens of thousands, perhaps hundreds of thousands of people here. It was reputed to be the most densely settled, I think, white area in the world in those days. And there were always people at every hour of the day and night. You could get a meal 24 hours a day, full of coffee shops, places where people would meet. Everybody knew everybody else, which was remarkable in such a large population. I've come back to the cross over the years. Uh, I was living abroad for a very long time. When I came back to settle in Australia, there was absolutely no question that I would live anywhere else. And I bought the house, which I'm now living in, in Victoria Street. Huh. <laughs> 